Hello, welcome to Mellow Mondays. Can't tell if this is too quiet, <laughs> the music, or if it's good. Let me know. Can I join? Uh, we're not playing multiplayer Terraria Dragon. It's just a chill stream today. My face is being blocked by the bunny. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, uh, I don't know. I haven't really actually streamed playing Terraria for a, a long time. Um, usually what ends up happening is at the end of every month, every Monday, the, the last Monday of the month, we just kind of chill and pet some pets in Terraria. <laughs> for a silly amount of time. Also, thank you everyone for uh, redeeming the pet the bunnies. <laughs> sure, you'll make the bunny very, very happy. <laughs> the bunny is way behind in pets, it's true. Welcome on in, Shippo, KC, K, Dragon. How are you guys doing? We're on a mission to give bunny more love. I appreciate that. <laughs> bunny deserves more love. All right, I should probably open the game. <laughs> That's probably step one. Um, there's an update, apparently. 
Oh, there's there's uh, the Steam Workshop support launches launch today. Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna download 2.87 megabyte. That's fine. Oh, we'll just go ahead and do that real quick. There we go. Then we'll uh, be on our way. Jippa says, I was an adult today. I got rid of old clothes, bought new shoes, and a new pillow, and a cheap vacuum cleaner. Yo, look at you, Shippo. <laughs> Adulting. Also, I guess you did end up going to Value Village, as you said earlier today. I should really do some, like, uh, spring cleaning um, of my closet. A lot of old clothes that I really don't need. <laughs> um... Yeah, a few a few hours after monster trade. Okay. <laughs> All right, let me just real quick let's get terrier set, and then we can begin. As usual, we still have the uh, good old pirate invasion <laughs> happening. Um, but that's okay. You know, uh, we'll give it a bit. See if the uh. Give it one sec. There you go, okay. And then we'll look around. It's a few hours. Oh, I already read that. Okay. Uh let's see. How how does it stand so far? Which probably can I pop this out? Yeah. Okay. Pop you out. So need you. Okay, it looks like we currently have 18 pets for the bunny, two for the dog, and two for the cat. So 18 minutes of bunny. I think we'd do better than that, but uh, <laughs> we'll start there. All right, and of course we're gonna start putting pet pictures. And if any of you Oh, I see that. Uh, <laughs> I see that Casey has has just begun wave two of the of the pet picks. Um, we will get that sorted. But first, let me let me just put up some pets for now, and then we'll we'll handle with that. that the folder blessed us with so we're gonna we're gonna go with this order <laughs> yeah the puppy's name is grace we'll soon see the puppy puppy is uh, about 12 pictures now <laughs> the folder here you have uh, beans the famous beans hold on I need to have the counter going just to see Still in the uh, hour setting. Let me fix that real quick. No. Oh. Found pictures of Bum Bum before she was chonk. Yo. <laughs> A lean Bum Bum. The 
they're going in pet picks. All right, sounds good. Grace, Gracie, she's nine weeks old. Her name is a bit of a misnomer. She's super not graceful. Jokes. Like she goes to sit down on her pillow and then she just kind of falls over and rolls off of it and gets so confused about how she, yo. We love, we love derpy dogs. <laughs> oh wait, there's already, <laughs> I didn't notice that the cat was right there. The lighting was so blended into the terraria background. Yo, thank you, Axel. Kind of covered up your <laughs> notification there. But... Happy anniversary, BB. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Axel. Thank you. Very, very kind of you. Uh, 12 months. A whole year. Good gravy. Uh, let me... Just put, put, put this over here first, and then let me put your name up on the light box. Oh, your name is already up on the light box. Well, I guess we're gonna have to take it down. Put it back up. Also, Steph is currently dying, so she will not be here today. Dying is not good for her health. Uh, but I, I wish her tediest of recoveries. Take care of her, Axel. What are you taking? <laughs> what are you taking me for our anniversary? Um, I'm taking you to Steph, so you can take care of her. Uh, but then after, I'll, I'll, I'll treat you to old fashioned uh, trash talking. I'm making her soup, but that might just finish her off. Oh no, mine great and emborfed? Oh dear. I fortunately don't have to experience migraine. That does, and I know they can be very, very rough. Very rough. Yeah. Uh, tell her to sleep on her left side as well. center your positive vibes yo thank you First picture of Gracie. That's in the folder. <laughs> Very uh, kind of moving around a lot in this one. So a little blurry, but there's more to come. Pop that there. Does box count as my pet? Um, <laughs> no comment. <laughs> as a pet owner, I believe that is your decision, Casey. I, I'm with I'm with the shippo on that one. Does he come when you call? <laughs> K brings up a valid point. It's 
Sometimes he comes. Yo, perfect. Sometimes he comes. <laughs> Yeah, sounds like a cat. Exactly. You do feed him. Nice. Well, as far as I'm aware, then Fox is a pet. <laughs> Uh, playing some Valorant earlier today, as well as a little bit of League, as well as a little bit of Osu. Osu! For those who don't know, Osu is like a rhythm game. Um, yeah, <laughs> it's a rhythm game. It's uh, you, 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 you click on the little, little circle things at the right time to the, the beat and the music, essentially. Um, first time I played Usu was probably around like a decade ago, and then I stopped playing it. It's free, but uh, I stopped playing it. I'm not very good at it, but uh, it's. I, I was like, okay. Um, <laughs> decided to to kind of kind of give it a shot again, and I'm like, yo, it is as hard as I remember. <laughs> Yeah, Casey is still uh, posting some uh, pictures in the pet pics. Still need to get through wave one. <laughs> still going, yep. I was playing League with Iris. Uh, she hadn't played League for like a year, and also when she played League, she didn't really play much of it. <laughs> um, it kind of reminded me, and and, and 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 if Iris, if you're listening, take no no offense. <laughs> it remind it reminded me that. Uh, um, the game's not very friendly to, new, it's not really friendly to new players in the sense that it's really, like, if you have someone who's played League a lot, and then you pair it with someone who's played League almost, like, you know, not at all, it's very hard for the person to, who has played it not at all to kind of get into the game um, and have fun with it, if that makes any sense. And I feel like League, although it now has a pretty good tutorial, sort of, <laughs> um, I don't know, it's, it's always been kind of like a steep learning curve, I feel. And you really just need to, like, but like you just kind of have to play with people around their same level for you to improve, I feel, uh, or to have to have the most enjoyment out of it. Um, like I personally don't mind playing with like people who are, are like new newcomers, but like you can tell that you know <laughs> the people who are new don't really enjoy it that much. Um, because, you know, they don't know what they're doing, but everyone else knows what they're doing, and then they get yelled at, and it's, it's not a fun time. Link is, I just found people kind of toxic, so I don't want to, yeah, exactly. Um, although, when it comes to the toxicity side, I think Iris was able to ignore it pretty well. <laughs> I said, I don't think she really noticed, but that, you know what, that's, that's, you know, that's, that, you know, that's totally, you know, to her benefit, so, um... Yeah. 
not a game that ever made sense to me, but I also did, didn't try very hard to understand it. It's like, for me, when I first started, right, um, I think Axel, no, Tal introduced it to me, and then Axel kind of, Axel was playing it, so then I think I started playing it or something, I don't really remember. This was a long time, this was back in first year of uni, I believe. Um, yeah, when I started, I didn't know what I was doing. <laughs> I would only be playing like the same champion over and over again, um, trying to do one silly trick, one gimmick, over and over again. Um, and then I remember like Axel being like so much better than me at the time. And I'm like, whoa, Axel, why are you so good? And then slowly, like over, I don't know, several months, right, of just consistent play, you eventually. This starts to get better, especially when you're playing with people. And there were a bunch of people and that I met that kind of just started playing as well, so then we kind of, you know, <laughs> got slowly better together. And then they got to this point now. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. I kind of. It's, it's, I don't know, League has never been a fun game for me if I'm playing by myself. I have to play with some other, with other people. My Yuko's brother first showed me, so already not a good first impression. Yeah. I do enjoy watching, uh, Professional League. But, like that said, Uh, also, give me a sec. Let me just make sure. I'm gonna make another folder. Uh, part two. Okay. <laughs> I drag this in. Boom. No, I I, I enjoy watching League. <laughs> um, but even then, I I don't watch that much my favorite team and only some other games I think I'm done oh wait I found more uh oh at the time is he not as good anymore um he's still I would argue he's still better than me but it's kind of hard to kind of uh measure it because we play different roles um so ra rather than judging him by his mechanical skill Right, because at some point, right, for League, it gets to a uh, point where it's not like mechanics that's the issue, but more of the d decision making <laughs> that's the issue. Uh, like what, like doing a thing at a certain time, like um, knowing how the how like what you should be doing at a certain point in the game, um, things like that. Um, in that way, I feel like Axel has a better understanding than I do. Um, but, you know. <laughs> Are you trying to carefully say Axel's not that good anymore? No, no, no. Axel's still good. He's just, uh, the, the, the skill difference between me and him is definitely not, like, that large anymore. <laughs> Whereas in the past, it was, uh... Hands down, he would just beat me over and over again if we were to have a one-on-one. -on -one. Um, a usual strat of just drag the picture to save it's not save this one. The last time I played by myself, League, must have been like 
five years ago by now. That might be a stretch. Maybe maybe like three years ago. Um, it's just not not fun. But why do I still play it? It's a good good question. <laughs> I play it because it's, it just hits different. It's not, it, it's like a game that you can't really fill the void with in terms of other games. So it's just, it's a unique experience playing League with the boys. <laughs> um, that you can't really get with another game. But at the same time, it's like none of the other boys are really having that much fun either. <laughs> So it's like, we're just there, and we're just like, yeah, sometimes we don't know why we're playing. <laughs> Bit of nostalgia too? Maybe. Um, I know some people like playing it because of the competitive aspect of the game. Um, but the other boys, some of the other boys are like, oh, I, 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 that's like the part I don't really like, is that people get really salty. <laughs> so... Um, and you know, I, I, I agree. I don't know, I usually, I'm pretty resilient to toxicity in the game. So I just kind of shrug it off and don't really let it affect me, but some of the other boys can be uh, rather toxic. <laughs> and I don't think that's very healthy sometimes. Um, but it's fine. Oh. So we, we, we've been pivoting to other games now and again, right? It's not always League anymore because we discover, yeah, it's, it's not very healthy for us <laughs> to always be playing League almost every night. Uh, so we start playing things like, you know, golf with your friends. You can, uh, you know, attract Karina along for the ride. <laughs> In that case, we played some Jackbox a couple days ago. Um, Scribble. And I feel like that's, you know, people have more fun with that. Well then eventually, <laughs> it comes back around to League of Legends, and then we ask ourselves, why are we here again, just to suffer? Oh my goodness, Casey, how many pictures did you send me? <laughs> I'm gonna have to shrink all the... Shrink what I have, <laughs> just, to, just to fit everything. I am in fact done now. Yo, okay. I, don't know, I lost count after 20. Oh no. Alright. I think I got all of them. So let's begin round two. Oh, I'm gonna have to shrink a bunch of things, huh? <laughs> Alright, we'll worry about that when it comes. Base control. Let's, let's put this over here. We're gonna, we're gonna make. We're gonna be smart with our space. And I have to remember I can also cover a bit of chat as well. It's not a problem. Um, I should also put the uh, all these guys. To the top. Yep. <laughs> so if any like alerts come through, they'll show up on top, like so. Thank you, Casey. <laughs> uh, thank you for the pet the bunnies.
Look at those eyes. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of dead space here, so do that. So cute. Very cute. Let's put this one right there. <laughs> Certainly don't want to cover up box. It's like Tetris, but with pets. Petrus. Welcome to Mellow Mondays, where we're, we play Petrus. Uh, space here. Um, I also realize I can't really put this picture here because it's gonna cover the pet, so let's shrink that, shrink this, do something like that. Then we'll uh, start covering chat up a little bit. Hey, three good, how are you doing? There you go, you don't happen to have any, uh, <laughs> pet pictures, do you? Add it to the, uh, the collection in front of us. Nah, I don't have pets. Yeah, okay. <laughs> no worries. I, too, do not have pets. How was your day, by the way? I've always wanted a dog or cat, but family stuff and also allergies. Yo, big mood. My my mom is allergic to cats, so don't really have uh, or cats and dogs, I think. <laughs> uh, so we don't have them in the house. Uh, my dad wants a dog. It's, you know, I'll get out. <laughs> I think when I'm uh, living on my own, I'll probably maybe get a cat. Not much going on, I finally managed to catch a break, so just chillin'. Glad you are here to just, just chill. <laughs> I see you posted a level into the uh, Mario Maker codes on the Discord. I'm looking forward to playing it, <laughs> whatever it may be. <laughs> yes, I did, yeah. Dotto has graced me with the presence on my lap whilst I'm sitting in the least comfortable position, says Casey. Oh no. Well, you better not move, Casey. Otherwise, Dotto will be very upset. <laughs> some space up here. Yeah, we have uh, 10 pictures to go. That's that's a forehead. <laughs> this is like one of those like um, I zoom in even more. It's like one of those like oh, what is this? Like what, 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 what is this? Can you guess what this is? And then the picture slowly zooms out. It's like, and then you 
are like, oh, of course, it's a box. <laughs> yeah, I believe that's one of Casey's pets, yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> anyway, uh, let's... Actually, hold on, a better idea. Let's, let's do that. And then we'll put box behind chat. All right, you get to be behind chat. <laughs> we get to type on box's face all night. Yep. Uh, okay, let me continue. Up this one. Hmm. This would be good to put we can put it here and then put it behind the uh not that one. Behind this <laughs> There's at least three pictures of box on stream tonight. Yep. <laughs> I spy a box. We're running out of real estate. It's upside down. Now yeah, let me uh, line this up with the uh, cats just to see. done yet though <laughs> I think this is rotated this way yeah. beans beans you can go oh dear you can go I don't want to cover box <laughs> um Right there. <laughs> so many pets. Pets and beans. <laughs> Empty space under Cato. Under Cato. Under Cato. Which which Cato? <laughs> which Cato? There's space here. Oh, under the Cato in Terraria. Ah, ah gotcha. Also see a little space like right there <laughs> we can put It's your fault for putting the cat there instead of the bunny. Yeah, my, my bad <laughs> My bad Casey, my bad. You're right. Um God, I don't really want to cover a box. I mean, this you can do this. <laughs> Try to use as much as the white space as possible. If it was a bunny, I would have just said the bunny and you would have understood. You're right. <laughs> I 
guess I could do that. But then it, you don't see the little, uh... Underneath, maybe I'll put this up here. Oh, corner here, seems good. Not being used yet. And finally, this is an oldie but a goodie. up most of the space there's still some like you know random space left over here and there but <laughs> it's fine i think i might have to pull a sebo and take a quick nap yo no worries okay i completely understand um let's start with the cat All right we'll end with the bunny um cat we have two pets for the cat two for the dog and then 31 for the bunny so let's let's get us started Okay, enjoy petting, I'll be lurking, yeah. Also, I forgot to say earlier, but thank you, Shippo, for the uh, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe uh, Redemption. <laughs> We're halfway there. Over halfway. Thank you, Casey, <laughs> as well. Uh, Casey, how was the rest of uh, Goat Sim, by the way? <laughs> Thank you, Kay, as well. <laughs> so chaotic. I mean, that game is just chaotic. <laughs> when did you leave, though? We had found K at one point. Oh, I think I missed that. Maybe I left. When did I leave? You were headbutting people, collecting money. Headbutt stopped working. It, you became a tall giraffe goat, a goat raff. Then you restarted the game. Then you were like, oh, I can help up people. And I think shortly after that was when I left. <laughs> there are clips from that. Oh, I gotta check that out. Jeff says, I will be listening. Gotta do some running. Ooh, what are you, ooh, or, uh, bleh, bleh. <laughs> what are you writing? What are you writing, Shiba? Oh, Okay, you were not there for a K adventures. Sad. <laughs> At one point, we found a baby K. Like a small, a small watermelon. While we had K. Oh. Shippa says I was watching some meme run Hollow Knight videos. Yo. You know? <laughs> Coincidentally, I was watching a uh, Kaizo Hollow Knight any percent run. <laughs> um, anyway, and I had a crack fic idea, which uh, my roommate is fully encouraging despite not knowing anything about Hollow Knight. Yo, enjoy. Yeah, when we hit 400 followers, we're start a uh, Hollow Knight randomizer, I think. Um, I think that'll be fun. Also a good callback to... <laughs> to 
one of the games we played. <laughs> Stream. If you or anyone is interested, I can post a link when it's done, sure. Feel free. Water streams. Yeah, the return of water streams. So, like, Streams on Mondays, you know, that is a good place now, I, f I feel. As like, I mean, I mentioned this so many times, but like games where we're playing like, as if it's like a let's play essentially, right? Um, it's a full playthrough of a game. Um, sometimes with some, you know, tweaks here and there. <laughs> like what we're doing right now with the Super Mario 3D World. Why, Green? Why must you torment me? But okay. <laughs> Become green. <laughs> oh no, I'm lost. Casey, no. Help. Well, your your I mean your 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 chat the chat's there your 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 chat but I guess other other messages that you sent are disappeared okay, what do you, I don't know why it ha that ha it happens to you all the time guys <laughs> why do you always lose chat but someone someone save Casey <laughs> but uh. I can only chat with highlighted messages? What? That's uh <laughs> That is a uh as odd. As very odd. I can't even see what I say in chat only on the screen. <laughs> Throws Casey some rope. Oh no. Oh no. I think I need to refresh VRV yet. Yeah. I think this is the most I've ever seen someone use highlight my message in a row. Um But yeah, I don't know, Mondays I have a lot planned for Mondays, I guess. Not a lot, but I have some ideas future Monday streams um because I would say like as as of now it's probably the most um not only like enjoyable of the of the streams in the days um but also the most I don't know I, I, I hate talking about analytics and things like that but like it's also the most uh popular of my streams I guess <laughs> it's my Monday streams which is strange because it used to be Saturday, um, but then, but then you know, <laughs> flipped around after a while. Uh, Mondays used to be my my least popular days, and then yeah, no petting. Oh my bad. There you go. <laughs> oh wait, hold on. We pet this cat for way too long. What am I doing? <laughs> All right, uh, ten. That's two minutes. <laughs> We weren't petting though. No, we were. It's just I, we stopped petting after. Um, I forgot when I clicked. Oh, we stopped petting after you after you requested Dwy Green. Was when we stopped petting. <laughs> Cause I know for sure I checked if we were petting at the beginning. Um, so I'm pretty sure we stopped when when I alt tapped. <laughs> Um, but let's... Because when I alt-tab, the, the game pauses, right? So then... I think... Stops. Anyway, dog is next. <laughs> Look, the cat already had too, too many pets! Look, the, cat, the cat's in the lead. How long do we pet dog go for? Uh, two, two minutes. Two minutes for the dog. 
<laughs> and then we have, I think, 30, 31 for the, for the cat. Sorry, not the cat, the bunny. Oh, four. Sorry, five. Okay. Oh, oh, Casey's redeeming. I see six. <laughs> Seven. And eight. And nine. Ten. All right, ten for the dog. <laughs> Thank you, Casey. Uh, but at some point, I want to return to Breath of the Wild. Um, we did a naked run. Uh, way, way, way back in the day. And we beat Ganon. It took like... I don't know, 18 tries or something? I don't even remember. Do we stick only run? No, I... I <laughs> the only way that would work is if we learned how to item dupe, I think. But, uh... <laughs> it's, it's a little bit above my, uh skill level i would say i feel like the best challenge runs for me is the ones that are just a little above my uh comfort level so then i can think of like strategies along the way um i, I feel like that's a little more fun <laughs> now i can run in master mode then no so i what my original plan is to continue the naked run but do the rest of the divine beasts that I skipped. So we will end up having like some exceptions where, yeah, we need to get the uh, Gerudo outfit to go into the Gerudo town. Um, like anything that's unavoidable, we'll put clothes on. But anything, but otherwise, we we have to be naked, <laughs> um, which is a shame because that clothes icon was completely grayed out in the original naked run. Which proved that I never picked up a single clothing item. Um, but, uh, you know, in quote unquote season two of Breath of the Wild Naked Run, we'll do the rest of the Divine Beasts and we'll also do the Champion of the Ballad um, DLC. I think that would be, uh, that would be fun and difficult. <laughs> I did learn some, like, tricks afterwards. How to how to make things a little easier. We'll end up seeing that. But I don't, again, I don't know when we'll do the Naked Run. It might be after Super Mario 3D World. It might not be. <laughs> uh, if, I, if I find something else I want to play. Um, we have a lot of games uh, that are coming out. That I definitely want to try and will definitely probably fit into the Monday slot. Beer B, my computer is trying to update something and is asking for the password to my computer. Or she doesn't have a password. I need to call Vox. Uh oh. Okay, Casey. Um, but yeah, no, I thinking of playing Pokemon Snap when it comes out. Thinking of playing um what else is coming out? Hold on. I, I wrote down a list. <laughs> I'm gonna briefly stop the petting. Ever so briefly. Uh... Ah! There's one I want to keep a secret. <laughs> and then there's also uh, Legend of Mana, which is one of the childhood games I played. Uh, originally on the PlayStation 1. It's coming on to Steam and also the Switch and PS4. Um, I'll be playing on the Switch version. I might end up playing that on stream, I don't know. Uh, but if I am playing it, it'll probably be around the release date, which is June. End of June, I believe. Um, but prior to that, there is something else I wish to play. 
but I don't think it's enough days to... <laughs> I don't know I'm gonna make this work, I guess, um, to have everything up be on Monday. Because um, I, I, I do kind of want to keep it consistent that Mondays is the, the you know, longer playthrough days, whereas Friday is more of like one-offs or two-offs. Saturdays are Super Mario Maker and or variety, <laughs> essentially. Or com and community streams. For this channel um, hasn't really been you know <laughs> great lately I'll be transparent about it I suppose um, I'm not really fussed about it though if I have to be frank <laughs> like it's not really my priority to to do so I mean thank you Zeno for the <laughs> for the raid by the way welcome on in let me give you a shout out because my mod is taking a nap, and my other mod is uh, ill. <laughs> so there you go. Yo, you've been playing Monster Hunter Rise. How how is it, Zeno? It's a game that I considered maybe picking. Thank you, Ash, for the uh, the pet to doggo redemptions. Much appreciated. Oh, need to uh, make sure I put all the. Uh, Stuff under nope. Oh the doggos Cancel my update for box to do later. Alright, awesome Casey. Alright, so we're we're gonna be petting the dog for 13 minutes um, instead of 10. Thank you, Ash, once again. And then we'll move on to the bunny. Gonna actually be petting the dog. <laughs> and I know, I know, Casey, I know, I know. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. I, I immediately knew. I was like, oh no, Casey's gonna call me out. <laughs> Thank you, Ash. We're we're up to 17, if my math is correct. This is now a dog petting stream, indeed. <laughs> this is my dream come true. Petting is important, indeed. Yo, thank you, thank you, Ash, for the for the pets. Oh, Casey with the bunny pets, the counter bunny. <laughs> All right, what what are we up at, up to now? We're at twenty for the dog. Twenty minutes for the dog. Hammy bread. Thank you for the follow. You don't happen to be related to a ham wheel, do you? Are you? <laughs> um, okay, all right. <laughs> that's a lot of uh, that's a lot of redemptions. Um, 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 we're we're gonna oh we're gonna go overtime. <laughs> no, I'm related to hammers. Oh, well, <laughs> come on in. Hammy bread. Hammer gang. Okay, I'm done with the redemptions. Okay, I'm out. Sivo. <laughs> yeah, what's up? You could turn off the redemptions. I could. I could. I think I will. <laughs> because we are... We are, uh... Definitely rocking the, uh... Pause that real quick. Pause that real quick. And pause that real quick. All right. How many dog pets do we have? I believe, let me look. We have half an hour, 30 minutes of doggo petting. We're at, oops, we're at 10 minutes currently. That's 20 minutes, 20 more minutes for the dog. And then we have 45 minutes for the bunny. <laughs> So we're gonna we're gonna go a little over time, but that's okay. Also, if you guys are wondering why my face is purple, 
because uh, I, had, I had to turn on a filter for the light to appear green um, because uh, despite you know it being I mean I'm showing this with a filter <laughs> but uh despite this being green right all right this one this one being green um it doesn't really show very well on through my camera so we have to apply a filter yeah <laughs> But uh, Zeno, how is um? Also, do you prefer me call calling you Zeno or Zenny? <laughs> also, yeah, I, I I need I need some backstory of of uh, why 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 Zenny the fire? Pink boat, Zenbo, <laughs> Zenbo, <laughs> pink boat, Y green, yes. Uh, but either Zeno is fine for old friends. Okay, sounds good. Uh, then I'll, I'll continue calling you Zeno because I'm used to calling you Zeno. <laughs> uh, Zeno, uh, how was the uh, Monster Hunter Rise? Zenny is a, a moniker that rose up while I was on Discord. Oh. And I went from Discord to Twitch, so Zenny just stuck. Gotcha. Makes sense. He says, Sibo's skin is actually purple. He is Dwise Pot and Svelter. I am. You can see, uh. It's taken over. <laughs> Monster Hunter Rise is great. Very wordy in the beginning, as usual, but I love being back in the Monster Hunter world. I played. I was like 70 hours of Monster Hunter World, roughly. I uh, never finished it. I uh, enjoyed the time I played with it. I really enjoyed playing with Axel. Uh, we would play together at the beginning um, to catch up to the rest of the, the boys before we did like four player or yeah, four player Monster Hunter. Um, it was a lot of fun. I, uh, I was the only one who would liked uh, catching critters for the room, for my room. I was like playing a whole different game. <laughs> and he says, I need to stop playing Monster Hunter and get up to date on story on Final Fantasy. Ooh. Uh, Final Fantasy was one of those games that, uh, I assume you're talking about the MMO one, right? Um, I haven't played the MMO RPG Final Fantasy. Um, it's one of those series that I never really got into fully at all. <laughs> um, the only Final Fantasy games I've played was Final Fantasy VI. I got, I would say, halfway through, and. Uh, I don't even know if you should count this for Final Fantasy Tactics Advance <laughs> um, on the GBA. <laughs> that I finished. But I also don't know if you would count that as a, you know, it's obviously not a, you know, what you consider a, a, a Final Fantasy game in the, in, the, in the main series Final Fantasy, right? Uh, Zeno says, I got to the point where you need to have other people to do missions like when they won't let you go on them on your own. Okay. Didn't know there was like mandatory missions. I didn't know there was missions that you, you had to have multiple people. Critter catching. Yeah. I was so happy with this rare beetle I found during the sunrise. Yo, it hung over my door for a door frame. And my pond was top tier and also the wigglers. Yo, the wigglers. <laughs> Fashion Hunter is my total jam. Yo, I feel that. I don't play Final Fantasy games. I just play it for the gear and reading. <laughs> the air is getting colder around you. Um, according to Terraria. I don't know what that means. I just hope that no casualties will be had <laughs> to pets. Um... 
Yeah, we'll, we'll worry about that if it causes problems. <laughs> Means it's winter, hopefully. Hopefully. It's a little foreboding. Yeah, no, the pets have HP, so I'm a little concerned that there will be some uh, cat lateral damage. I'll still be here for all the dog pets, though. Yo, uh, what are you going to eat, Zeno? Save the pets. The uh, pets seem to be fine. I mean, they're surviving the pirate invasion, but that's because pirates can't go through walls, apparently. Um, pasta, nice. I love pasta. I had some pasta earlier. Well, I ate some leftover pasta, pasta today for lunch um, that I made on... Uh, what day is it today? Today's Monday. I made on Saturday? Yeah. Cat lateral damage. Uh... Oh, no. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, God. Okay, abort. 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 Okay, we gotta, gotta go over here. <laughs> you guys can't see what's happening, that's fine. Um, actually, I can probably... Will this work? If I do this... And then... Capture any full screen. There we go. Okay, now you guys can see what's happening. Just, uh, not a fun time. Let's just put it that way. We're also gonna die. But I'm okay with this, because... We just gotta, we just gotta... Have, have... Him not be near our home base. Right? He's gone now, right? Yeah, he's gone, he's gone, okay. So we want to... Reseal this. I think everyone's okay? Yeah, they're all good. Sassy's at 223. Yona, Yona's fine, and uh, I don't, I don't know how the bunny's doing, <laughs> but the bunny seems fine too. All right, we're, we're, we're good, we're good. Uh, gonna do the usual, getting rid of this wooden chair. I know the timer's still going. We'll, we'll worry about that when it becomes an issue. <laughs> Well, why don't we switch back to uh, the screen, I mean. Okay, let's backtrack of the timer a little bit, if possible. Um, is that possible? How do I do this? Hold on. If I stop, I can adjust it here. Let's put it back to 1630. It is definitely not dog petting. It definitely is not. Um, fortunately, no one died, so it's good. <laughs> uh, what was I talking about? By the way, chat. <laughs> oh yeah, I had pasta. Saturday. I think that that was the end of that conversation. <laughs> Thank you for the Stay Hydrated Redemption as well. A reminder, take some time to drink some water. Thank you, Casey. Uh, I may, uh, may refill my cup of water uh, when we switch to bunny petting. But, uh, you need to remind me. <laughs> Thinking of things to, to talk about. Um... I don't know, Monster Hunter World... Or Monster Hunter... I had fond memories of it. It was fun when I was played it, when I played it. I don't know why I stopped 
Like, eventually, you just kind of get bored of games. Um, even though there was still a lot in that game that I had yet to experience. Um, I don't know, I just got bored of it, I guess. <laughs> you should maybe do it now while you remember. I'll, I'll remember when the, when the cup is empty. <laughs> um... I don't know if I'll pick up Monster Hunter Rise. I might wait a little bit to see. Or I might even wait uh, instead play on the, on the PC. Chug. Thank you. <laughs> I will go and get some water. Try to not knock everything over. Yo, so, thank you, Casey, for gifting a gift sub to Dwybot. Be right light box to put it back on. Boom. <laughs> Dwy box should be on the light box. We already have Dwy on the light box, but we could put bot. <laughs> Where's Anita O? Oh. Now I need a T. Bot. Alright. What? So everyone fits. There you go. We have. Shirley, Axel K, Bot, Casey Quack. <laughs> um, lately I've been playing a lot of Xenoblade. Uh, definitely a lot farther than stuff is now. Uh, <laughs> there's a lot of side quests in Xenoblade though, like a lot. Um, I feel like there's almost too many. <laughs> I think there, there's a, there's an odd balancing issue too with monster with not monster Hunter, with uh, Xenoblade. I mean, uh, where that you you if you do all the side quests, you get just super overpowered, which is fine because they they did include a way to level down. Um, it's, it's almost like a band-aid fix, you know? Um, I feel like it's just better if you just have, like, it to not be a thing. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I feel like they, they made it so that you don't have to do any of the side quests. Um, get through the game to just streamline through the story without having to grind. Um, well. But by doing that, they made it that doing the side quests made the game too easy. <laughs> it made the story part too easy. Um, so Rather than me complaining about it, I should just really level use use the level down system that they provided, but um it's just it, it doesn't seem like an elegant solution. Um 
but I am still enjoying the game a lot. Uh, I really, really enjoyed the locales. Um, Axel was saying the other day, like it's. It was. It, it seemed. It seemed really. <laughs> Axel got mad. That well, not like actually mad, mad, but like he got like. He, he's fr he was frustrated watching Steph play. Not not for not you know anything that Steph was doing, but the fact that. Uh, yeah, the the gate the world is pretty big, but there also doesn't seem like there's anything. Do, like there's like there's long periods of time where you're just kind of walking or running um, and I kind of agree yes there's a lot of monsters things to collect but like it's just a lot of emptiness not not so much like it's it's yeah it's just not not much to do I guess other than combat um, collecting things and just, just walking around and looking at the sightseeing essentially um granted they have really really pretty sceneries in uh xenoblade but it's not like breath of the wild where breath of the wild you had physics <laughs> like you had you could play around with physics there are a lot of things you could do in breath of the wild it's a huge sandbox where um it's a lot of variety and, and it's like, you had a lot of the, the Lego pieces, I guess. And it was up to you to kind of figure out how to use the Lego pieces to build something, <laughs> to build a toy, um, build a playground. Um, whereas Xenoblade, you're kind of just like, the, 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 the gameplay is in the in the combat. Um, you're either fighting, walking around, or collecting things. Is essentially those three things you're doing. Um, and there's not much variety that can be found from it. Um, save the combat where you can play as different people. You can control different people and experience different play styles. Um, hey, Amwheel. Uh, earlier. <laughs> We we had a we had a we had a what was it? hammy bread follow <laughs> come in probably from yeah from uh, Zeno's raid I was like hammy bread are you related to ham wheel by any chance but uh no he was related to uh, hammers according to according to them so <laughs> how goes the gaming oh it's it's going we're petting the uh, the dog. For a solid 30 minutes. I, I disabled the petting now because uh um we'll go over time if we <laughs> if we do any more. So it's uh that's where we're standing right now. That was summoned. You were summoned in a way. Yes. Exclamation mark ba, by the way. Um Casey says we got attacked by a giant skull thing. Yeah, we got <laughs> got attacked by a Skeltron Prime. <laughs> Um, I had to bust a hole through my, through the home so that all the pets would survive. Yeah, it was almost a cat catastrophe. Um, how, how was, uh, how was your day, Ham? Ham Whale, how was your day? How how have you been? It's been a been a little bit. <laughs> Work been busy. Um, yeah. How, how how are you holding up? Always happy to see you um, on Mondays. <laughs> I don't know, Xenoblade, it's just, it's good, it's a good game, but I see some flaws with it. <laughs> I'm beginning to see some flaws with it, um, but I'm enjoying it nonetheless. Um, Hamwell says, it's getting overwhelming, super busy with work, but it gets to get it, hopefully. You can do it, Hamwell. 
Well, I believe in you. Um, remember to take some mental health breaks every now and again. Always good to, of course, like, you know, do your best to find some time to just chill, you know. <laughs> Went boarding today. That was all right. Nice. Really icy snow, though. I helped my parents clean their house that they're building. Didn't know you snowboarded. That's cool. Um, uh, as a person who doesn't really go ski or snowboarding that often, what's the uh, reason behind like not wanting icy snow? Is it it's just like harder to control? We're just chilling in a trailer for the night with one bar of service. Oh no! <laughs> Surprise you! You're you're you can manage to watch the stream <laughs> with one bar of service. That's cool though that your parents are uh, building a house. Hard packed and icy snow gives you less grip. You can't control how fast you go. It's hard to control yourself. Gotcha. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah, I would. I I probably would have noticed if I if I want more. <laughs> and or maybe the days that I have gone skiing, um, have always just been good. Or maybe it's always been bad. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I haven't gone skiing or snowboarding for. Long time though. A few years, at least. Yeah, it's been a few years. Um, the last time I went was I went, it was I was part of a bachelor party um, where we went skiing slash snowboarding. I don't know what year that was. I can actually look this up real quick. <laughs> Spring snow when the sun is out makes slush really good for carving, but the sun went away and all froze. Oh no. I like the stuff that's really cold and fluffy just after snowfall. After snowfall. Um, let me see. I did take a picture around the time. Okay, it's been five years, five years since I went uh, skiing or snowboarding. Yeah, 2016 was the last time I went. Uh, snowboarding is a lot harder, personally, in my opinion. <laughs> Um, I tried it a couple times, but it was, it was difficult. <laughs> I have never been snowboarding. I, I just don't have like a, my, my sense of balance with my legs in the greatest. I don't know when it comes to that. I'm also not really good at skateboarding either, either so. <laughs> Iris taught me, uh. I had a teacher we skateboarding uh, last year. It's fun. <laughs> um, Hamel says there were a couple. There was a couple of days this season with over two feet. Also, we're done with the dog. Let's uh, <laughs> move on to the bunny uh, before I forget. Sorry. Then you're gonna we're gonna put okay, the bunny has moved. The bunny has moved. I repeat, the bunny has moved. Okay, <laughs> gonna do that, and then we're going to just 
stop this timer, set it, and I will continue reading chat. Okay. Hamel says, uh, there was a couple days this season with over two feet of powder. It was awesome. Yo. Two feet of powder. Wow. What is powder past your ankles? Is a bit much this shit, though? And says, no, the deeper the better. You're supposed to just float on top of the powder. Oh. Maybe it's different between skis and uh, snowboards. Maybe. Maybe snow maybe snowboards prefer deeper. I don't know. <laughs> my skis weren't cooperating with me at the time, I guess, says Chippo. Someone got in my boot just by standing there. Never been snowboarding since Casey. I've been snow tubing once. I don't think I've gone snow tubing. I went to Montreal Blanc, but it was during not winter. <laughs> so they had the uh, I forgot what the what it's called. Like during the you know warmer seasons, they would have the course that just you would dip in like a thing i don't even know it's been so long it was, i was i think when i went was i was like 10 years old so i don't recall anything but like i remember there was this thing that moved like a slide that you would sit on but there was like it was like a we were sitting on like a sled or something and then you would just go down like a, a slide or something <laughs> Casey says, snow tubing is easy. You just sit in a giant tube, hold on, and someone shoves you down a hill. So it's like tobogganing, but with a tube. But it's been since high school for snow tubing, so over a decade now. Wow. Yo, Casey, you know, sometimes, do, do you just feel old sometimes, Casey? Because I, I do. Um... <laughs> uh, Anvil says, yo, I have a dog with me. Can I add him? Yes, yes you may. Feel free to add it to the uh, to the uh, pet pics. Uh, if you have already, then I will. Anvil says, I don't ski anymore, so I don't really know. Casey says, I felt old today. I was driving to work. I coughed and threw my back out. Oh no. Poor Casey. It's mostly better now. That's good to hear. Lifting things at work was interesting, though. Yeah, you know, have, have you heard moments where you're just kind of staring and then blank, and then you just, you just, your mind just wanders, and then you stop thinking? That's me sometimes. <laughs> anyway, uh, Casey says, he's in there. All right, awesome. Hey, well. uh, Casey says, also, everyone wanted things from the bottom shelf. Oh. Use your legs, Casey. Use your legs. The number of times I like threw my back, lower back, by bending, like by lifting up objects impro not properly. Too much. <laughs> Too much. What a fluffy dog. Uh, I think I saved it. Wait, where did I save it? Uh, oh, there it is. Okay. Where are we going to put you? right there <laughs> oh kind of covering me um 
go. I have an empty spot right there. Just move some. Nope. Pretty hard uh, finding <laughs> the space. <laughs> thoughts with Sibo. At least you were just sitting there doing nothing wrong and cough and threw your back out. Oh no. That's true, Casey. That's true. <laughs> I can't say that that has happened to me before. Um, I did realize, like, sometimes I sit too long, right? And then my lower back starts hurting. Um, it's because my old chair would have no lower back support so that's why i started putting a pillow behind it um and that definitely helped up a lot like i don't didn't have a lower back pain ever ever since so um as far as i'm aware after that so <laughs> that was good and now i got this chair uh had have to adjust to it a little bit admittedly um I feel like I'm perpetually either falling off, like forward, like my bum is slipping, like this way. I can't really adjust it either. Um, or I find myself sitting at the very edge. I'm just like, what am I doing? I feel like I'm gonna ruin the chair. <laughs> Emma says, I'm still young enough to be durable, so I just gotta get all my injuries in while I can actually recover from them. Honestly, that, that's a very fair point, Hamwell. Um, yeah, the, the younger you are, the easier it is for you to recover. Yeah, in a way, yeah, take advantage of that. Um, obviously don't, like, hurt yourself intentionally, but, like, you're, um, you're more privy to taking risks, I guess. <laughs> See, but did you have to assemble the chair? Um, yeah, but... I don't know. There, there's some like things I can adjust, right? So I can adjust the the arm height. <laughs> I can adjust the you know chair height. I can adjust the tilt tension, like how much I have to push back to tilt it. Um, I can't, however, lock the tilt in place. Like, I can only lock it in a neutral position, so now now I can't tilt backwards. Um, I read a post somewhere where someone bought a chair and put it together and felt like he was falling off all the time. Yeah, some, some chairs are just... I mean, this one's actually fine. Like, I just feel like I just have to get used to it. Um, and I've been slowly getting used to it, so... The first couple days when I got it, um, definitely took some time to adjust. <laughs> Turns out he installed the seat backwards. I don't... I don't think I... There's no way. Okay, I can, can confirm. I did not install the seat backwards. I'm looking at it, it doesn't look like it's backwards. <laughs> let's, let's put it that way. Um... Yeah. Definitely not. I'm like 99.9% .9 sure <laughs> it is not backwards. But very good theory, Casey. Very good theory. more no more creaky chairs chat don't have to deal with the creaky now we just have to deal with the uh, faux leather sounds <laughs> my phone's almost dead i think i gotta go all right take care ham wheel thank you for popping in i can't can't everything catch anything it's okay ham wheel um well, we love you regardless um yeah 
hope hope uh hope you won't hope hope work will be hope, hope work will treat you nicely and hope you get some rest um enjoy your uh time in the trailer i suppose <laughs> I, I, every time every time I talk to you, you seem to just be somewhere else. <laughs> One moment you're moving, then your, your, your old house, then then you moved, new house, and now trailer. Apparently your, your parents are building a different new house. Uh, you know, it's just it's a it's a wild time. You're working at a pizza place, and you're working at Amazon. It's like <laughs> you know, never a dull moment with you, which I like. <laughs> Have a good night, my friend. I forgot to tell Hamwheel that we might do a Hollow Knight randomizer. <laughs> I feel like he would be pretty hyped about that. That's okay. We'll catch. We'll catch him. We'll catch him uh, next Monday. <laughs> uh, let me think. I'm sure he will be back at some point. Yeah. You know who we, we haven't seen for a while? I, I I hate mentioning these things, but like we haven't we haven't seen Morg for a while. I, I wonder what uh how he's doing. Is he on the Discord? You could always tell him there. He is on the Discord. He is on the Discord. Um, <laughs> that's true. I could I could tell him there. <laughs> I always see Morg online on Switch. Um, I mean Morg. I, I feel like Morg just has a Switch on. <laughs> Constantly, because like for the most part, you just he's just always online for me. Like sometimes I wake up at like 4 a.m., turn on the switch, be like, oh, more in Super Smash Brothers Ultimate, huh? <laughs> but uh, I I just I I think he's just uh, he AFKs a lot, right? I think he talks on ba Box of Smash channel a lot. Yeah, I mean, he, uh, he really, like, Smash Ultimate is his, his jam, so, not surprised. I just hope he's well. I just hope he's well. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, um... Maybe he hasn't. I, I mean, you know, <laughs> just no, nothing against uh, more. <laughs> could be like schedule changes. Could be just um, loss of interest. Could be just busy. You know, you never know. Um, I never really ex like. I never want to. You know, expect anyone to kind of show up to my streams. I guess <laughs> this is my uh, my approach. Um, I treat it as like, you know, you come to watch, like, I'm, I'm very honored you've decided to take some time out of your day to, uh, to watch me just do whatever. <laughs> get popular or whatever or like or uh demand attention um for me it's like it's more like if i can bring you know some joy to people's lives like if they enjoy you know coming in and watching me um just hanging out and talking then, or even lurking um it, it brings some positivity in their lives then like Feel like I achieved my goal, I guess. <laughs> I, t 
attention what to bet, so demanding it would not work. Ha oh, ha ha, Casey Hawk. Oh. <laughs> um. But yeah, we also haven't seen uh, me. I mean, Mia popped in for one of the Pikmin streams. <laughs> this last time we saw Mia, but they, uh, I think they they've just been busy in general. I feel they they all they also haven't really been streaming much. Um. And base and his dad jokes are rubbing off on me. Dad jokes are great. Uh, yeah, I don't know. We, we've had people, you know, come and go stream. Um, but they, they always end up, you know, <laughs> a lot of them end up like showing up at some point again. Um, always happy to see. Steph has made a recovery but is avoiding lights. Yo, tell her to take all the time she needs. Like honestly, tell tell her that she should just just she should just sleep. <laughs> she should just rest, or 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 find Ziva and hug her, or like you know do everything, just make her as comfortable as possible. Um, yeah, avoiding lights is a good idea. Exactly. Ice packs leave Advil staying hydrated. Yeah, last she's feeling a bit better. All that jazz. That jazz. <laughs> you know, I kind of feel bad in a way sometimes. Um, like I know, like I don't really watch other people's streams that much anymore. Um, like even. <laughs> Even the streams I've abided, you know, it's like, I, I don't know. It's like, I, I, I find myself, it's difficult for me to kind of just sit and watch for like multiple hours, I guess, uh, of a stream now, nowadays. Uh, I partly blame it on ADHD. I partly just, I don't know. It's, be the main reason to be honest <laughs> um like but if if i if, if i like show up to like your streams and i just kind of i'm just there for like a little bit um uh, disappear don't take any offense to that i guess um it's not that i don't want to watch you just that like i don't know i'm just it's not i don't i don't really Watch Twitch stream does that long anymore? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's, I, I feel I, I I come to a pretty uh, <laughs> yeah. What, K, Casey has the the uh, the 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 benefit and or uh, the opposite of the benefit of me coming in for like roughly half an hour, I would say, and then I would be like, I'm gonna take a nap. And then I lurk for the rest of it. <laughs> and then when I wake up, I end up on Flybox's stream. <laughs> I, I feel like I feel like I've collected a lot of passive channel points on Fly Flybox's streams. You know, I applaud you, Sivo, for being able to nap through my chaos. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> It's just, I, I, the afternoon lull hits me so hard. There's usually a lot of shouting. Uh, is this the, is this the part where I tell Casey that when I'm napping, I, I may or may not mute, uh, my audio? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hey, there you go. <laughs> Welcome back, and or maybe you've just been here this whole time. <laughs> Axel says, I've collected a lot of passive subs as well. 
Yo, Mood. Hi, I'm back. Yo, welcome back. Yeah, so I, as I was saying, right, like, I don't really watch games very much anymore. Um, even, like, like staff streams, I mean, you guys know, like, I <laughs> I don't really talk too much, to be honest, in, in people's streams. Uh, I just kind of lurk for the most part. Um, occasionally just kind of bop it in, like so. <laughs> um... I do try to at least lurk on Steph's stream, though, for the whole thing. Um, so I feel like, in a way, I have that responsibility on my head as a, as a moderator. <laughs> um, but, yeah, I don't know. As long as the stream is open, it can be muted. Yes. I don't know if you can actually collect channel points when you mute the stream. You, you, you should be able to. Um, yeah, if it's behind another window, I think it stops killing me. Something like that. Um, I also, like, I mean, it doesn't matter. You could, you, or, like, I, I flip flop between muting the stream through the player, or, or I, sometimes I mute the tab. <laughs> um, either way works. I'm I'm pretty yeah I'm pretty sure you can collect a channel point. It's like I collect a lot of of uh, Fly of Fox channel points and streams were you know muted because I muted the player AC stream. <laughs> so when I end up going over with the raid, you know I'm still getting some passive points out of that. Um, <laughs> pretty sure it's the worst. What happens to Axel's old man at Dwai? On the one message what what do you mean old man do I <laughs> Axel said a whole bunch of messages one doesn't have his old man do I Oh. oh, 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 <laughs> you mean the badge, I see. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Twitch is weird sometimes. <laughs> Which do be weird sometimes. Also, I noticed that, uh, the dog is wanting some love, and we're petting his butt right now. Oh, he moved. <laughs> got all his love bunny turn it is bunny turn now lunk on lunk I need to think of more games to play on Friday. This Friday we won't be playing anything because uh, it's Good Friday. Um, I'll be attending an online uh, Good Friday service, church. Uh, so I won't be free. I'll be free to stream. <laughs> Not that I would have streamed on Good Friday anyway, even if the service was at earlier. <laughs> Just kind of uh, one of the days where I don't really, yeah. Just rummage through your suggestion channel. That's very true, Casey. I do have a lot of games on Steam that I've never played. A lot of games from. Epic Games store launcher thing that I never played. 
all those free to play all those free games that they, they come up with, like once a week a lot of twitch prime gaming games you know <laughs> um a lot of those are also having free i need to play those uh, I feel like those would be good candidates for Friday streams. Um, scratch that itch, so that itch.io bundle still, still pretty, you know, still has a lot of games there that I can play. Um, a lot, a lot, a lot of options left. I'm telling you, League with the Boys PG-13 filter off. I might consider, like, Axel, if we end up finding, like, a co-op game to play. If you're down, play it on stream, on a, like, on a Friday stream one of these days. But only if you're down, of course. And only if we find a game. Those are two things that are... <laughs> well, okay, one of the things are much more difficult to do than the other. I'll let you ponder which one is which. <laughs> I found a spider game that I might play on stream in October, but I don't know yet. Spider game? There's lots of spiders. Spiders. So many spiders. Yeah, we're gonna have to go a little, little overtime. Um, oh, 10 minutes overtime. Stream. Today, but that's totally okay there would be a lot of screaming so i don't know but casey you scream all the time on stream <laughs> welcome back shippo have you finished your uh your fic i hate spiders yo big same casey big same What's the what's the game called anyway? <laughs> oh, Axel, have you played a little more of Origami King? Chippa says about uh, 1600 words in, not very far through the rough outline. Gotcha. 1600 words though, that's pretty impressive. I wouldn't be able to write that much in, a, in that that time frame. Let me check my wish list. Gotcha. Uh, the plot is to kill the spiders, I see. Axel says we need to spend roughly a week to decide what co op game to play. Yeah, it's um, it's a process. I have not. I was gonna, but the apartment has been in darkness for the past four hours. Oh, right, right, right. Because, because Steph. Gotcha. I like your, uh, methodolo methodolo meth methodol methodology? Philosophy? Your, your approach of, like, you decide, okay, I'm gonna play Origami King, or playing, playing the Switch only, only on the couch. It's a couch game. I like that approach because it's like you kind of set up a, you know, a space where you, that's what you're going to be doing in this space, and that's that's where you're going to be playing that game. Very different vibe. <laughs> I like that. Shippa says I tend to write long things fairly quickly, so long as I have an outline or some sort of plan to keep me on track. Yeah, I'm not able to do that. <laughs> I am not able to do that. Yeah, it is a setup. It is a it is set up as a completely different feel. Yeah. Yeah. Um, maybe I should do the ah, eh. <laughs> eh, but then I have to no. Then I don't want to leave my room if I wanted a different setup. I guess if I got like another. Sometimes I would just, uh, I would just, you know, when I'm playing on Switch on my own, I would just, I would have my computer off. And, you know, only the mon this monitor on. Um, 
playing the game. But the, you know, somewhat different feel, but not different enough. <laughs> it's called Kill It With Fire. Oh. <laughs> Spiders are so useful, says Shippo. No, no spiders, says Casey. That's true. You know, Shippo is right. Spiders are good for the house. Um, kills all the other bugs. But, <laughs> but they just need to not be in our space. That time, they can, they can, they can do, they can do whatever they want as long as they don't, as, they, as long as they don't, they don't approach the bubble. As long as they don't cross the bubble, the personal bubble that is that that has that's that's growing, that has grown, that, that grows a lot bigger, for a buck. Slash erect. It is different though because I live only stuff. I wouldn't do it this way with my parents. They'd ruin it. Yo, I feel. My peace, that is. They'd ruin my peace. Yo, I feel that. <laughs> as soon as Sputter is within my arm's length, it is too close. My my my, my peace, quiet, is, is an afternoon nap. <laughs> uh, I can't even bring myself to kill them myself. I have other people do that for me. When I kill spiders, the walls a lot of soap. Soap. Usually some screaming. Oh, to wash your I see, I see, I see. Spiders always run at me for no reason. <laughs> they like you, Casey. They like you. Spiders, spiders usually just chill in a corner and do nothing to ship out. Apparently the, the light switch strips attracts a lot of bugs because of the heat. Fortunately, uh, it seems like there hasn't been any bugs yet, but I'm a little wary now that it is, you know, it's a warmer season. Um, <laughs> so I never really have these lights on outside of streaming. <laughs> Need a Dwy with a face mask for napping. <laughs> Honestly, it's a good it's a good idea. They drown in soap. <laughs> There's no changing my mind here, no spiders. Uh ship says bees and wasps can be aggressive for little to no reason though. It says, I'd like to put a spider down between Casey and I and watch it make a mad dash for Casey. <laughs> what is this chaotic energy, Axel? <laughs> Eye mask, whatever it's called. Yeah, no, I, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. We're gonna run out of the playlist soon. E have a few more minutes. <laughs> what is what is this chaotic energy with the SpongeBob uh, face? You know that, or whatever. This way. I don't. I don't know how. To <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> anyway. Um, So yeah, no, Friday, Friday, we won't have a stream. Saturday, Super Mario Maker 2. We're gonna continue that endless run. I think we're at 12 wins so far, so let's see if we can keep going. <laughs> see how far we can get. We're pretty healthy in terms of our life count too, so. Um, excited to see where we can take that run. Then we'll play three goods level. Um, 
still debating. Like, games that we've played in the past on Fridays, like Part-Time UFO and Planet Coaster, um, honestly, they, they may return. Probably will return. <laughs> I just don't know when. Like, about the space between the return or not. Um, because I enjoyed Hard Time UFO a lot. I feel like if I was to do Planet Coaster again, I would do like a campaign mode. Maybe? Let's see. <laughs> um, and then I'm not even gonna touch the YouTube side of things. <laughs> I feel like, I feel like every time I try to do YouTube, it just kind of fizzles out. So I still have three Hades runs in the, uh, in the, in the backlog. One of them I have to re-record. I think it was Casey's. I have to re-record it because, um, the audio and the video did not sync up properly. I, I, and I realize I can just kind of manually adjust it, but I'm like, you know, it's been so long that I'm like, I might as well just record another one. <laughs> I, I feel like I should, uh, approach it differently. Yes. Um, yeah, we'll say. <laughs> Axel says, so I've actually played also good night, Shippo. Good night. Uh, Axel says, so I've actually played a lot of this one game that kind of has a good feel to it. I don't know how into it I would be since I've played it so much, but I feel you may be interested in it. I've also never personally listened to the plot, so I could look at it from that angle. The game is outward. Six hours. This reminds me of my warnings to you on YouTube. Yeah. Um. Outward, huh? Hold on. Outward. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I remember you playing this. I remember you playing this. Also, frame drops, hello? <laughs> right, we back. It's weird. Some severe frame drops there. Um, yeah, I don't know. I, uh, maybe I'll check it out. But yeah, I, I think like if I, um, I'm gonna record Hades again, too. I think I'll, it'll be like super, super heavy, heavily cut, like cut run, <laughs> like really, really cut, um, to only show the interesting parts, um, but we'll see. <laughs> That's a lot of cats. It is a lot of cats box. Um, cause like, that's weird, right? Cause I really enjoyed making really like heavily edited YouTube videos. Maybe not enjoyed the process of doing it to be honest, but enjoyed the end result. Um, you know, before I streamed, um, like a few years ago, I did the Undertale Let's Play. That was the most I've ever edited a series. Um, but I feel like, in my opinion, it was really well done. Uh, I kind of want to bring that vibe back, I suppose. Um, but it's also a lot of work, so I don't know. <laughs> yeah, you're on there too, Box. You're, you're behind chat. Watching chat very carefully. With bum bum. <laughs> the next time I make a YouTube video consistently, it will be pro programmatically done or heavy use of macros. <laughs> uh, how do you even uh, 
How would you even do that? <laughs> I mean, I won't question it, because you've somehow managed to find ways to make things work. You're still watching chat carefully, from all angles. You can say box is reading between the lines. He's also to the right of Sibo, carefully watching Sibo as well, it's true. <laughs> true. Well, hello, Vox. Boop, 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 boop. Sibo. Yeah, Vox? What's up? <laughs> My new level is in testing. Yo, I heard. I heard. Um, excited. I'm excited. Do you think it'll be ready on uh <laughs> by uh by by Saturday? I don't know if I'll have time to play both yours and three goods level though. Um it might just have to be one or the other. <laughs> and but then we'll 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 do it you know, the next Mario Maker 2 we'll play the other one. Um mostly because we have that endless run we have to complete. I don't know how long that's gonna gonna take. Oh, two troll levels. Okay, you have two two troll levels. Let's see. Nice. <laughs> Cause like, you know, historically it would take me I mean three good levels usually take me about half an hour. Um like thirty minutes to forty minutes. Box, your levels usually take me like five minutes, I would say. <laughs> Might be able to um, fit everything if the endless run crashes and burns. <laughs> but I guess we'll, we'll see. 45 minutes, not five minutes. Have it still. Five minutes for a troll level? That's, that's, uh, the, uh, I, d I don't think that's ever happened. Um,. 45. Sometimes an hour. <laughs> Back there, the, lately there's been a lot that's been going over the hour mark, and uh, <laughs> that's when I start going a little loopy. Usually the usually the first troll level I play of the, of the, the day is fine, right? My, my, I'm just I'm cool, and then and then the second one just hits me real hard. And the, like, my brain just doesn't want to work anymore. Uh, Box says, I promise you, they're easier than the, the garbage will do and trash, trash and all the foods. Okay. Okay. Easier as in shorter, I assume? Or easier as in actually, you know, easier? <laughs> like, what, what, how do you define easier? Easy versus not easy in a troll level. Less evil? I guess less evil. Less evil, gotcha. Yes! Binding of Isaac's new DLC. Is it out? Is it out? Is it out? It's, it's not out yet. I thought it was out tomorrow and or day after tomorrow? But also, I would never play Binding of Isaac on this on this Twitch channel because highly not uh, PG thirteen. <laughs> yeah, March thirty first. Yeah, that's what I thought. I thought it was the end of the. Uh... Like, I don't. I mean, in the past I played Binding of Isaac, but <laughs> I just kind of ignore the fact that you know it has you know. <laughs> those themes but you know um because I, I ignore that then you know you get a really good at the time anyway a really good roguelike experience but mm, i don't know lately i've just been um like i watched northern line play it um because those are those are the videos where i don't really watch the gameplay of it so much i, I just i watch it just to listen to him talk 
and he's had a baby so it's like sometimes it's it's northern line and the baby in the morning this is I or his Isaac videos nowadays and it's just like it's great <laughs> I don't know how much heck of a drug. Uh, yeah. I don't know how he, he, he manages to, like, upload four videos, three to four videos a day. And now he streams, like, every day except Saturday or... Yeah, and he streams for, like, six hours or something <laughs> every day insane um very good says i just got a call that i was absent for fourth period which only meets on wednesdays <laughs> excuse me <laughs> glitch in the system perhaps also we we have uh exceeded our heading timer so this is where we'll call it I'm quits, but let's uh, update the timers. We'll uh, get on out of here. Uh, so 45 minutes, so we're at 235 minutes for the bunny. Slowly catching up. Dog has reached the 400 mark, 401 minutes. Um, and the cat, 375. <laughs> have i tried to get you to play raft with me yet Sibo? no i that's, i was actually like you know now that we finished valheim i would be actually down to play raft with you <laughs> um yeah no i'd be down especially since you said like there's a lot of the game you haven't experienced yet though so it's called, almost like the opposite of what we did for valheim right for Valheim, I had the, the head start. Um, and then for Raft, it would be you. But I, I, I'm, I'm down to play Raft. But yeah. <laughs> uh, let me see. Let me switch over to here. Hello, I'm still purple. It's just the way it is, you know? <laughs> it's just sometimes you're purple. Sometimes you're blue. Sometimes green. Sometimes it's gonna. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. It's fine. <laughs> Sometimes you're rainbow. Anyway, um, hello, still purple. I'm Casey. Hello, Casey. I'm still purple. Played like eighty percent of the beta content twice. So like that is that a lot? That sounds like a lot. <laughs> but uh you know, you could experience you can experience me oh, Axel, you shouldn't have. Thank you for sending the gift. This 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 man has sent me a raft. Um, he knows I'll be stranded on an island soon. <laughs> Man's looking out for me. Anyway, uh, thank you to... Welcome back, Box Bulldog. Thank you to... Oh, gosh, hold on. I need to close all these tabs of, of Dot and Box and Bum Bum and Puff and uh, Greasy and... Yeah, we're going to close all of that. There we go. Um, and then we're going to forget that we didn't open the credits page thing. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. Uh, thank you for the quote, Casey. I need to update the quote um, directory. It's been a little while since I did that. Um, but apparently we hit the 500 mark at some point, I didn't notice. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, 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 hold on. Let me end credits. Axel says, it's not like, it's not, it's like not a lot since I had two major updates since the beta. Okay, gotcha. <laughs> thank you for moderating, Dwight and K. And 
thank you for the follow, Ham and Brip. Thank you for the resubs, Axel, and also the gift sub, Casey, to uh, Toy Bot. Peak content for five hundred. Yo, that that's such a good quote. Um, <laughs> dude, I actually like can't wait for more Toad levels, cause like. Um, also, let me switch back here, cause like, uh, no, we're not doing 500 push-ups for 500 bucks. Maybe we will. I don't know. That that's actually a decent idea. Except I would die. <laughs> um, maybe, maybe, maybe something along those lines. Um, but no, I can't wait to play more Super Mario 3 World. Specifically with Captain Toad levels, because how stupid they are with the with the co-op uh, setup I have going. Um, but I I realize that what I can do for those predictions, um, for the Captain Toad level is like, will I run out of time? Would be the uh, prediction for for the Captain Toad levels. Like, will I run out of time before I grab all the all the stars? Uh, that gives you time to build up the muscles. 500 pushups for 500 followers. Yeah, yeah, it might be a while till that happens, so maybe we'll be, maybe we'll be very, very, uh, <clears throat> built by then, you know. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna send y'all over to, uh, probably just, uh, let's see. I'm gonna send you over to Jamie, Vidya, um, who is currently playing Harvest Moon Magical Melody. I believe he is trying to learn to speedrun Harvest Moon Magical Melody. So let's just hop on over. Um, yeah, let's let's hop on over. This is the yeah. I don't I don't know. What I'm I mean we're already. This is technically post credits already. So I don't know. Uh, let me get this all set up there you go okay um learn give him my love raid message um uh ba -ba -ba -da -ba -da. hashtag i couldn't think of a raid message <laughs> and then a bunch of emotes Hashtag, I couldn't think of a raid message. Yeah, do Casey's. Casey's is a lot easier to read. <laughs> that one, yeah. <laughs> All right. Thank you for watching. Um, toodles. I couldn't think of a raid message and then a bunch of them. Um, bunch of emotes <laughs> thank you casey thank you all right thank you guys a little bleh, bleh. thank you for watching see you guys on saturday